guys, great to see you all here. Awesome having you back here with me. Today we're going to be briefly going through uh, research methods, okay? And that's the methods you would use to collect your information, to collect your data, all right? In order to support your hypothesis, in order to support your educated guess, right? Or prediction, right? Which will then ultimately answer your uh, research questions. So the kind of methods that you can use in order to collect that data, collect that information, all right, for your uh, research project. Let's get straight into it. We're going to be looking at three today, all right. First one is going to be on uh, qualitative, qualitative. The second will be on quantitative, quantitative. And last but not least, we'll have a look at uh, mixed uh, methods. Let's get straight into it then. Let's look at qualitative then this is one method of data collection and qualitative it's all about describing okay when someone is describing something uh, perhaps to you all right so it's more on about how and why it's more in-depth analysis right so when someone is describing something to you okay in great depth and great detail we call this method of data collection qualitative all right so qualitative let me give you an example here um, I love drinking uh, tea all right so for example with qualitative okay I'm going to describe how I find drinking tea drinking this tea it's really smooth has a, a rich uh, taste and sweet taste so qualitative, okay, data collection, there you go. I am actually describing uh, to you something, all right, which you could use in your research report. I've just described to you uh, how this tea tastes. It's, it's maybe rich, it's very smooth, it's kind of sweet. This is all uh, descriptive information. So qualitative, try to remember, it's when someone is describing something to you. Okay, so that's a, a good uh, way to remember qualitative, okay, data collection method. Now, uh, on the opposite side, we have quantitative. Quantitative sounds similar, right? <laughs> but it's quite different. Quantitative, easy to remember, it's all relating to numbers and kind of numerical data. All right, so it's not about description. It's not really going, to, going into great depth or, you know, you're not really digging deep into a, a topic and describing it. Quantitative is all to do with numerical types of data. So, for example, let's have a look at this tea I'm drinking. Uh, each morning, uh, I fill this flask up. It's about one liter. And throughout the day, maybe I will uh, finish 500 milliliters of this. Okay, so one liter, 500 milliliters that's kind of data right that's relating to numerical types of data that you can use in your uh, research all right there so it's not really you're not really describing something it's more to do with uh, data such as one liter one liter this is all data 500 milliliters this is uh, numerical types of data all right so try to remember the differences between uh, those two all right Moving on to the third uh, method, we have uh, mixed methods. So imagine this is, is coffee and I have some milk and I'm mixing the two together, all right? So this is, I'm mixing qualitative and quantitative together, all right? So mixed methods is when you use qualitative and quantitative uh, data collection methods. It's kind of using both mixed methods, kind of mixing uh, those both uh, together, all right? So maybe for a questionnaire, you could use uh, maybe a Likert scale, maybe yes or no answers, multiple choice. This will be, you could say, be quantitative data uh, collection, right? But when you're asking like short answer questions or even long answer uh, questions, this is where you're going to be collecting a lot of uh, in-depth information. This is going to be qualitative, all right? So when you have like quantitative and qualitative, mix them together 
it's what we call kind of like a mixed methods here. All right, guys, so uh, those are those three different types uh, of uh, data collection methods. So once again, qualitative, remember, it's more about describing something, the way something smells, maybe feels, right? But quantitative, it's about numerical data, numbers, maybe statistics, for example. And mixed methods is when you have both of them uh, together. Awesome, guys. Hope these uh, tips have helped you. And uh, as always, take it easy and stay awesome.